So are we looking at another Drakari hit or two earlier? I think the the best list will catch a lot of people out, I think. Okay, but before, we're not done yet. We're, we're going to build the list. Right, okay. So, Goths or Beast Snaggers? Uh, snake Bites. So, Goths, a six scores one additional hit, and you get plus one strength. That's pretty good. Snake Bites, you can't be wounded on better than a four plus with strength, unless it's strength eight. And you get plus one to wound roll and a turn you make a charge. I think snake bite is better for the squig list. But you get plus one attack if you properly kill it and you get plus one AP. Right, okay. We're going to do it. Let's get our battle scribe up. Um, I've got an exclusive version of battle scribe open that has the new squig, po the new points, as you can see. Snake bite. <laughs> Patrol. <laughs> We're right in the list. Okay. Squig. Oh, so. Big boss. 145. That's 123. 145. Squig work better as Goths. They are all T5, so the trans orky doesn't benefit them much. Exploding damage 7 is a win. You can always mix as well if you wanted to. The only difference is you can't use that extra stratagem or wall trait. Uh, relic, sorry. Are you bothered? Deny power, not bad. And the relic's pretty terrible for snake bites. Goths probably have a better stratagem, but it's 2 CP. So you could mix. You could. <laughs> Mikey, if you haven't heard of snake bites, unsubbed, brilliant. Right, okay. Hen, beastie boys. All right, well, we've half for in the list. We'll just mix, why not? Let's do it, okay. Mozrog, Scrag, bad. Big chomp. He's 160. We can do it. We'll just mix, who cares? We literally lose nothing because we're not bothered about that strategy anyway. Right, and then we'll go uh, goth patrol. Okay, quick boss. 145. Why are we stopping it? Why do we have to play Goths? <laughs> Squig Boss. <laughs> 145. Beastie Boys. Right, and then we'll go Kill Rig. Ah, oh, it's one boss per detachment. Ah, very good. Very good. True. True. Triple Patrol. Triple Patrol. Let's go. Kill Rig. And then Goth Patrol. Quig. We've nearly wrote the entire list, guys. Quig Boss. And Beastie Boys. Kill rig. We broke the list at the end. Did you enjoy my battle scribe? I enjoyed it. Look at this, look at this game. It's my new battle scribe. It's exclusive to Hellstorm World Gaming. You have to subscribe to get access to it. 1360. What, what should I spend the rest on? We need a weird boy. Yeah, we'll put a weird boy with the snake bites. 70 points. Okay. Okay. Too bad. Got Fist of Gork and Jump in there for 10 my 10 beastie boys. Uh, right. How many points are the squig riders? Because you don't have, you have all those squig bosses, but you don't have much to protect them. Squig hog boys are twenty five points per model. That ain't too bad. Squig riders, squig hog boys, times three. All right, that was cool. We can do that twice. Why not? You want commandos? Why commandos, gamers? Commandos can forward deploy. True. Commandos, flash kits, and squig buddies. I'm not bothered about flash kits. Squig hog buggies, which will protect the characters. Rucker truck squig buggies. 90 points 90 points for a squig right okay cool let's say three of them <laughs> what why the 90 points so they stay as a unit so three separate they'll protect my characters hell yeah let's go gamers why are they only 90 points 1760 that's where we're at why can i fix so much stuff in an orc list where it's all really good commandos how many points are commandos <laughs> I don't want to buy a squig army because I'm writing it for you. Don't forget, guys, this is actually coaching. So um, I'll be invoicing you all £50. Or you can just subscribe and I'll, t I'll take that instead. Or you can Twitch Prime. Let's Twitch Point Prime to find out how. 10 points a model. Let's just take 20 commandos. Fuck it. <laughs> so we thought she will struggle to get to 2,000. <laughs> Let's just take 20 commandos. They are elites, right? For the forward deploy. Plus 200. So we've got 40 points to spend. What should I give the commandos, gamers? They can take a lot. We've got 40 points for them. Got them choppers, rocket launchers, custom shooters, burners, distraction grots. You think there, you've got... You've got three big, nasty characters that are gonna, like, wreck face. Right? Right, three big, nasty characters in Moz, Rog, Scrag, Bad, the Squig Boss and the Squig Boss. You've got three kill rigs, which are horrible, right? You've got Squig Hog Boys to play the mission. You've got Commandos to play the mission. You've got two Rooker Trucks to run out and help your characters and protect everything. And then I've got, like, 50 infantry. 
<laughs> and I've got like 50 infantry. What does the distraction grot do? Part of the kill objectives objectives and dare your opponent to deal with the far side devil fish trap, but on crack cookie. Yeah, exactly. Once about when the bear is to fight, you can treat these models in this unit as if they were within one inch of terrain. Yeah, okay. That's pretty good. They get plus one to wound as well. 50 T5 infantry, yeah. Um, give them both a distraction grot. We've got 20 points left. I think that's a pretty bonkers list, to be honest. Not going to lie. That's it. You've got 20 dudes to play the mission. Rucker trucks cause the speedy. Yes, a screenshot was taken. Right, how much is this list going to cost? <laughs> is the list going to cost more than the points? <laughs> is the list going to cost more than what it what the points cost is? Move one kill rig to snake bites. Why is that? Is that so you can cast powers on him? Can you take bomb squigs on the commandos? I'm not sure. Bomb squig. Yeah, they can take bomb squigs. Are they 10 points? Bomb squigs are 5 points. They're going to be left with 10 points each. Put bomb squigs in the squig cogs as well. All right, cool. There you go. There's the list. We did it. 2,000. 2,000 points. Right, okay. None of this, except for the rucker truck, you can actually buy. The rucker truck and the weird boy. Okay. <laughs> so uh, let's go to Gaze Workshop. How many wounds is that list? <laughs> okay, let's do wounds first. So uh, the Mosrog has nine. Uh, the Weird Boy has five. The Beastie Boys have 10 together. The Kill Rigs have what, 18? 16. 16, close. Uh, so plus 16. Another Squig Boss has nine. 10 Beastie Boys have 10. 20 Commandos, so plus 20. Uh, two Rooker Trucks, they have nine. Two Rooker Trucks have nine. So that's plus 18. Plus another 16 for the Kill Rig. Then another Squig Boss. Another 10 Beastie Boys. The Squig Hog Boys have three each, so that's another 18 there. And then 16 for the Kill Rig. 157 wounds. Beasties have 11 because of Knob. Cool. Uh, one. They'll also have a Knob in there. So one, two, three, four, five, five. So plus five. 162. So it's 162 wounds. <laughs> cool. Right then. Let's have a look what we can actually buy right now. We're not be snagger boxes. We're not going to do it that way. We're just going to have to work it out. Uh, Xenos armies, orcs. Right, rucker trucks are 30 quid each. Okay. Okay. And then we can buy a weird boy as well. Where's the weird boy? That's a lot. It is a lot, gamers. Weird boy's 15 quid. Okay. And we can't buy anything else right now. So we're going to have to guess. Okay. We're just going to have to guess. So where are the commandos? Commandos are £25.50 for five. And they come in fives in the unit choice. Because I've bumped it to ten. It's five to fifteen. So I think it's safe to say. I think it's probably safe to say. If we said the commandos were £35 for five. I think it's safe to say the commandos are going to be like 70 quid a unit. Would you say? New commandos, I think, come in 10s in their box. That's only if they decided just to put 10 in kill team. But the unit choice is starts at 5. So what are we saying? 35 for 5? Or is it going to be like 45 for 10? Pay to win in 4k settings, so alright. I know, right? What do you think? Do you think 35 for 5 sounds right? So 70 quid a unit? Do you think £39.50 for 10? £32.50 for 5 plastic? All right, then. Shall we be reasonable? Shall we be reasonable? Re reasonable. Let's say £42.50. Right? £42.50 for 10. Let's meet everyone in the middle. How much are flayed ones for 5? I think about 30 quid, I think. Okay. So that's that. 10 Beastie Boys. The closest thing we've got is 10 Orc Boys. Hey, thanks for following. I really appreciate it. The closest thing we got is 10 Orc Boys. Which are £22.50. Right, they're not going to be £22.50 when they come out. I, I would show you eBay, but they're going for about 30 quid. Not sure where the 50p will be, boy, because they like adding 50p on things, don't they? So you reckon 30 quid for a Beast Boys, minimum. 35 for 10, 35 for 10, £32.50. Everyone's saying 35. Let's say 35. Let's be reasonable. 
35 for 10 Beastie Boys. Squig Hog Boys next. Squig Hog Boys. What do we have to compare? We have the Gorgrunters from Foyk, from AOS. How much are they? Gorgrunters are 48 pounds. <laughs> They're 48 pounds! <laughs> what? Oh, uh, no! Why? <laughs> uh. <laughs> I was like, 30, yeah, it'll be 38 quid. This, these are a bit bigger, but... <laughs> 50 quid for three? Ooh. Outriders. How much are Outriders these days? Is that a good comparison? Because it's 40k. 36.50, you reckon? You reckon 36.50, not 48? <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's because you can only get them in the start collecting box outside the web store. Right. Gold Grunters are quite big. Let's let's be reasonable. We'll say 40 quid for the squigs. How about that? We'll play on the safe side. A little bit more expensive than Outriders, but much cheaper than those. Bet my bottom dollar is the same as Eradicators. I think they're 3150. They're really cheap. If the sprue doesn't change, the squig cogs will come with the smasher sprue squig. Yeah, that's true. So you'll be able to sell them. <laughs> no one will buy them, but you'll be able to sell them. Right then. We've got two units to work out now. Now, it's safe to say that Mozrog Scragbad is the same kit as the Squig Boss. But how much? How much is the Squig Boss going to be? That's the question. We don't have anything to compare. Probably Gaz level, you reckon? Same price as Gaz? How much, how, how much is Gaz these days? 42 quid? You think 42 quid for a squig boss? How much is a Vengorian Lord on slot from Soul Blight? Soul Blight's quite expensive. But that's probably the closest thing we've got, right? Is that the Vengorian Lord? £39.50. That's quite cheap, to be fair. 30 quid for a big rider. Same as Val. £37.50. 29 Fenry, I think you've been a bit, a bit safe there. 45 for a squig boss. Would we say 45 30 quid? You think a squig's going to be 30 quid? No way the squig boss will be more expensive than gas, but he's massive. £50 for a gloom spike mangler squig. Okay. Mangler. Oops. Ooh. That one's 50. It is two squigs, though. So is it going to be 25? <laughs> They're £50. Greeper says 68. You know what? I wouldn't even be surprised. Let's just search squig. See what comes up. What what do we have to compare to? Loom Boss and Giant K Squig is about this big. That's it. <laughs> we just got Mangler. Squig Boss will be definitely 45. A lot of people saying 45. I think that's a safe bet. 40 to 45. I'll put 40. All right. Let's go with that. Right then, next one, gamers. Last one. The Kill Rig. The Gigantic Kill Rig. That's all we need to guess the price for. 70. 70 pounds, I'm gonna say. Catan is 68 quid. It is ridiculous as well, Grim Reapers. 70, 70, 90, 80. Greater demon price. It's 85. Bellacore. How much is Bellacore? 89. 185. 140 USD. Right, we'll put. I think I think 75 or 70 is the most common. About 70 is the most common. Let's be reasonable. We'll go for the lower end. We'll go for 70 pounds. Okay. A reasonable a reasonable price, I would say, for quite a large kit that looks terrible but is really good in the game. Right. If we price everything up, I think we have. So the list is bang on 2,000 points. It has 162 wounds. Pretty much all of it has an invulnerable save. Plus 70. It's going to be 675 pounds. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Did I do that right? <laughs> Surely it was not that much. Did I do that right? Did I screw up and add a few hundred by accident? I don't think I did. £675. 
for the next list. <laughs> uh, cheaper than Adbeck. <laughs> That's less than a Stormboard. <laughs> Stormbird. <laughs> uh, and this will get nerfed within like two weeks. <laughs> Plus Caradex, all right. Yeah, so. <laughs> I thought you just meant this. I was like, yeah, it's all new. <laughs> but yeah, you meant the Gold Grunters. Uh, okay, so times 0 0.8 to get it from a local store. Maybe 500 quid. And I've got 540 quid. One second, one second. Just need to have a look at something. Okay, gamers, there we go. Um, I'll just put that on the screen. If anyone's interested, uh, just thought I'd let you know that this is a thing. Um, oh, actually, i got a typo in there. There we go. Guys, if you want to help out, get my new Orc army. As you can see, it's very nice. It's very nice. It's only £540, very reasonable. Um, <laughs> please don't donate. I'm kidding. Please don't. <laughs> I say, so, hey, thanks for following. That is so expensive, gamers. That is ridiculous. <laughs> Better own mech guns at £1 a point. Yeah, it's like... What? <laughs> Go, Melina. Thank you very much for the five. Really appreciate it. Thank you very much for the tip. <laughs> I just turned the goal off, so that didn't count, though. <laughs> well, it didn't count, sorry. Um, and watch it. We'll save this, and we'll readdress this when the price has come out. We'll, we'll address this um, price when uh, the prices are actually announced, and we'll see how close we were. So if anyone doesn't know, if anyone doesn't know this, but I've opened it, but I have all of the models here. I'm giving them away on stream on Saturday, Saturday the 31st of July. I'm celebrating my one year anniversary of being Warhammering for a whole year. Um, so I'm going to be giving it away for free to someone in chat. I'm giving away a whole load of other stuff as well. I'm giving away some Admech, I'm giving away Sisters Army, I'm giving away Bellacor. Um, I'm giving away uh, Dominion. I'm giving away parts from Dominion. I'm giving away some other stuff as well. So make sure you tune in Saturday, July 31st at 10 a.m. And uh, we'll be giving away prices all day and playing some fun stuff. We're going to play uh, higher or lower. We're going to paint some Sisters of Battle. We're going to play marbles. Um, so yeah. So make sure you tune in. <laughs>